Grace. Today I'm going to read the Bible story. A baby and a bush, birth of Moses and the burning bush. Egypt was filled with Israel when the new power was offered that the Israel would become too powerful so he made them slaves and treated them very badly. Israel people's right? <laughs> like in Israel there were too many boys so the Paro said like the Israel will become too powerful and they can like harm our our country so they he have treated him very badly and he also was like treating him very badly more badly than other time power older that all baby Israel boy has to be killed. One man put her baby in a basket and he then hide by the river. His sister watched him. wanted to like the baby would not killed so he she have like hidden her in the his him in the basket that means he is the what the hell he is A boy, right. Oh, there's a The Tarot made the Israel slave because the they he saw they will become too weak. No. Paro's daughter was bad thing by the river she found the baby and decided to baby and decided to keep him his sister offered their mother and helped for care for him for him Paro's daughter named him Moses. Actually, this is my daddy. <laughs> like 
so just keep sister was watching at her because he worried about the baby and finally the Paro's daughter has got the baby and they have wondered about he she have decided to keep him so like but she don't have baby so she cannot give some milk to the baby so that his sister said that my mother can help you like this they wonder <laughs> grew up one day, he saw an Egyptian bat beating an Israel. Moses killed the Egyptian. Then he fell to Melter and was a shepherd for 40 years. Like Moses was very... Wait, do you know that Moses saw that... Mm -hmm. Um, he he knew that he was an Egyptian, no, Egyptian, Israel, and so Moses saw Israel beating one one that was Egyptian was beating to Israel, so. Moses has killed him. <laughs> Moses was watching his ship on the Mount Harbor. The voice of God spoke from a burning bush. My people are suffering, Moses. I have clothed you to free them like one day god has spoke in the burning bush and said to moses um, make my 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 people free and uh, god was saying Then we will be very like surprised because it was a burning bush and the it didn't burn, right? I can't, Moses cried. I will help you, God promised. Throw down your staff, Moses did. It turned into the snake. When he picked up, it was a staff again. God showed some mark things that when he dropped the snake it will turn into the snakes and when he grabbed the snake and it has been the stuff again wow question how did God speak to Moses number one the burning bush number two the basket and number three paro number one is the correct answer put your hand in your cloth god said moses did he looked at it was covered with jesus when he did it again it was help show Paro that and God has shown one more thing like when you put your hand into the clock it and put it out like the thesis was here and when he have put it in and back then it has gone like clean
I don't want to find out. <laughs> I am not good at speak speaking, said Moses. I will give you the words, God said. Your brother Aaron can help you. So Moses went to tell Pharaoh to send the Israel free. Do you know that? Like when he was a shepherd, he also married. Question God tell promise to help Moses when he went to tell Pharaoh to let the Israel go. True. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Uh, do you like the story? I love the story. I think the next story will also be a good story. Yeah, actually, I was like seeing Daddy for some time is because I have to put something there, but I didn't write. Them. I will show you I, the next story. The title is Let My People Go, The Plate and the Passer. Passover. Yes, today I read the little story. Did you like it? I have enjoyed it. <laughs> yeah, did you enjoy it? Please comment and subscribe it. And bye! There's the button there. There's a button there. You can press it and subscribe it. Then bye!